to ask you, I've seen you quoted uh, in the Korea Herald as saying, as a direct quote, the likelihood of Band running for president is higher than before his visit. He currently sees his run for election as one of possible options, which is a change from his previous position. Since this question comes up in here a lot, we don't really get any answers. Is your second part of that, that how Ban Ki-moon sees the possibility of running, is that based on conversations with him? And in what capacity did you say that? Thanks. Um, I didn't say that. You know, the, uh, the reporters put it in my mouth, you know. I only said that uh, because they asked me about what uh, Mr. Ban said during his uh, uh, press meeting in Jeju. Uh, and they tried to interpret it as, uh, as uh, him uh, announcing his intention to run for Korean president. So I said, no, he didn't say that. If you look, read uh, carefully what he said in Jeju, he said that he will make decision he will concentrate on uh, his work, the remainder of his work as Secretary General until the end of the year. And then he will make decision on, uh, on what he is going to do after that. And he will do that very uh, carefully. That's what he said. So, so there is no mention of running for president. Uh, but he... In the past, he di didn't uh, make a comment on such a question, but now he was saying that he was going to make decision on his future upon the completion of his uh, duty as Secretary General. So that's the only difference. And, and the media interpreted as, well, then there is a, a higher possibility of him running for president because he didn't mention it in the past. Now he's saying that he will make decisions. So that's how they interpret. I didn't say that. They did put it in quotes. I want to ask you one, one oh, follow-up. Uh, hold on. Well, you allowed Mr. Abadi to have like three follow-ups. So. I have a follow-up and then Joe. Okay. And it just has to do with sort of the, 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 the uh, fair treatment or, 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 or higher low profile of ECOSOC. What I wanted to ask you is, for example, when the Security Council meets, all journalists can stand in front of it. All journalists can stake it out. All journalists can speak to diplomats going in and out. In the case of that ECOSOC high-level political forum, it was impossible. The majority of journalists accredited by the UN were, 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 were unable, unable to stand in front of the meeting and speak to people. I, you, to your credit, when you came through the turnstile, did speak. But do you think that this is an appropriate treatment of ECOSOC as opposed to other organs uh, of the UN if, in fact, you want coverage? Well, because of usually don't have any uh, stakeouts, but I didn't know about any arrangement. For no, I mean, the, the policy was the same, that uh, reporters are able to access from the third but floor. But stakeouts, like the Security Council today, everyone's it's, standing it's, in front it's of the it. Standard, it's the standard policy where reporters can enter from the third floor. Yes, Joe.